Cole Riggins getting ready for his second start as a Royal. Jeff McNeil leads things off. Ground ball to the right side. Nice play by Massey. He tossed it over to Witt to try and get that play turn. I don't know if you've ever seen that before. A little creative by Massey. Uh, Jeff at first. Here's Francisco Alvarez who homered last night. And he takes a four pitch walk. So as you said Keith Cole Reagan's big arm but big problems with his command and there are two on nobody out. Swing and a miss. He went with a cutter on the outside corner. Now Lindor fans for strike three. Uh, here's Alonzo with McNeil at second and Alvarez at first. Garcia makes the play at third. No chance for a double play. And there's two down for Mark Vientos. To right field. Waters is there. And the Mets are scoreless. The new ace is on the mound today in Kodai Senga. And in a tough season, Senga has been one of the few bright spots. Grounded back to the middle and into center field. Love that. That's beautiful. From 0 and 2 to 3 and 2 to a base hit to center. Hunt. Now Bobby Wood Jr. up there. And now a line drive base hit into left field. So the Royals, like the Mets, begin the first inning with two on and nobody out. Now let's see if the Royals can capitalize. Melendez grounds it right side. Out at second, no double play. First and third, one out. That brings up Salvador Perez. 2 2. Swung on a miss, strike three. Senga gets him with the curveball, 73 miles an hour, and there are two away. So now it's up to Michael Massey. Yeah, how about a drive into the right field corner, off the wall, and the Royals will get two. Yes, he jumped on that. That's a way to get. Some first inning runs. Reagan's gonna like that. Oh man, yeah. ready to go, ready for a fastball. Man, and put it right in his wheelhouse. I thought it had enough to get out of the yard. And the bases are loaded for Matt Duffy. Sanga looking to limit the damage. The one-two to Duffy. Swung on and missed. Strike three. Got him with the ghost fork, and he limits the damage indeed. Inning number two, and Brett Beatty leads off. Into left field, Melendez is there. One away. Here's Jonathan Adayuz, switch hitter batting right. Now fooled by a pitch. He started to swing. He went around. That's a strikeout. So here's Rafael Ortega. Fastball threw it right by him. Swing and a miss. Kodai Senga facing Kyle Isbell, the lefty. Isbell hits it off the end of the bat. And with the count 0 and 2, he is on with a leadoff single. The Royals, for the second straight inning, have a leadoff single. And now he sprays one to right field. And the Royals. And back to back innings have two on with nobody out. So two on. Now the Royals can inflict further damage on Singa. And he gets a line drive to left field. Isbell is on his way, and the throw is offline. So Bobby Witt Jr. down in the count, drives in Isbell, and the Royals lead 3 0. Six, 60 second RBI. Nice job. Got him another fastball. This was in. He pulled his hands in. We know he can hit those inside fastballs. That brings up Danny Mendick, the former Chicago White Sox infielder, outfielder. Base hit by Mendick through the hole in the left side. And Danny Mendick has his second hit of the night. And that'll bring back the top of the order, Jeff McNeil. As McNeil slaps that one into left field, goes the opposite way, and he's got a three hit night. The Mets in business, first and second, one out. Here's Alvarez. He can tie the game with one swing. And a changeup away gets him a big strikeout against Alvarez. Francisco Lindor, switch hitter bats right handed. High fastball is lifted to right. Waters is there. And now Salvador Perez, who has struck out both times he's been up there, will stand in. Salvi golfs it. Deep left center field and down. Digging for second, and he's going to dive in head first. He believes he's safe. Second base umpire John Tumpain took his time before calling him out. Yeah, he, Salvi might be right. Look at the nice job of separating his hands and keeping that right hand on top of the base before the tag was made. Yeah. Salvi, he definitely was committed going around first base. I'm thinking to myself, don't do it, but he did. After review, the call on the field is overturned. The runner is safe. Kansas City will the challenge.
17th double and he earned every bit of it. Olivares has been on base both times he's been up there tonight. 2 2 swung on a missed strike three and there are two outs in the top of the sixth. Now Jonathan Arauz comes to the plate. Grounded right side and through. Vientos is around third. Waters doesn't have a long throw and it is going to be in time. Drew Waters came up throwing in right field. A perfect throw to Salvador Perez in the air. And then he reached back across the third base line to tag Vientos, trying to slide in feet first. And that polishes off six shutout innings for Cole Reagans tonight. Francisco Alvarez on for the second time. That will bring up Francisco Lindor. And now Lindor hits it to deep left center field. Isbell is there. Now it's Alonzo, and he is 0 for 3. Tied him up. There you go. Double play. Oh, man, that's a beauty. And now Drew Waters. Drew has walked, flied out into a double play and struck out last time up. Drew Waters, deep right field, and gone. Waters, out of nowhere. And that ball just jumped out of here. That wind was blowing early in the game, but it's not now. That helped little slider. Didn't do a whole lot. Just kind of wrinkled right there in the middle of the plate. Look at that leg get Load the hips. And there's the power generated from his legs. So back-to-back -back walks with two out in the top of the ninth. Daniel Vogelback coming up. And if the Mets can get one more batter to reach, the tying run will come to the plate. That's going to be a base hit into right field. Held up at third base is D.J. Stewart, and the Mets have a chance. Jeff McNeil coming up as the tying run. Bases loaded, two outs in the top of the ninth. There you go. On the ground to second, and Massey throws him out, and the Royals have won five in a row. Outstanding work. Taylor Clark signature pitches his change up. He's able to take care of it there. That's exactly what you want to do. The guys are rolling. It's nice to see. 